Hi guys, you're back with just M in Emmerdale part 13. Now, in this episode, we're going to make our way up the stairs behind me and we are making a potion room. This is the room where I'm going to grow my nether warts and do all my potions and such and such. Now, the idea for my potion brewers has come from 2020 MC Gaming. So, kudos for that, my friend. Uh, and we're going to start, guys. I've actually put my nether wart farms in here. And we've got a couple of gaps knocking about in the walls here for the chests. And for my infinite water supplies, which are going to go there. No, don't take it from there. Right, so. Let me see. Have I got my slabber dabber -doos? So, the slabs over the top here. So that's where one of my water places is going to be. And the other one is going to go in here. I've got another water bucket downstairs, guys. I'll not worry about it too much. Right, on to the design of the actual potion brewer. Right, so we need, first of all, a dot of redstone. And we are going to need our redstone torches. Now, the dot of redstone will go in there, and the redstone torch will go on there. It's actually a 3 by 3 that you need to build it in. Okay, guys. Right, so, our next step is to put a couple of blocks on the front, like there, and one over the top of this redstone. Just shift-click, and it shall go on, like so. You also need to put your chest on the front. I'll just get rid of some of this tat in my inventory because we're not going to need that for the time being. Right, stone button on your right hand side. Uh, wood button on your left hand, right hand side, stone button on your left. Now that's to do with signal strengths, guys. It has to be stone on the left and it has to be wood on the right or you won't get the required signal that you need. And then I'm going to pop a chest in the middle, like so. Then we're going to put another two blocks there, and we're going to get our repeaters out. Have I got them out? No, I've not. Where are my repeaters? Yes, they are. They are there. Repeats are going that way. Repeats are going that way, and that is going on three ticks. Okie okay. Then we're going to get a torch there, and we're going to get a torch there. And we are going to put this hopper into the back of the chest. I like so. We are then going to put a block above them two torches. And we've got that for the time being, guys. Okay. Now, we don't need our chest at the moment. We are going to get our droppers down. Now, we're going to put... A dropper there we're going to put a dropper there and we are going to put a dropper uh, right there and then we're going to do the same again underneath these droppers so you want one there one there and if I can get under that one one there like so then you want to put your brewing stand, wherever I've put it, down here, like so. And a hopper on the top, going into your brewing stand, and that's where all your ingredients is going to go. And that, my guys, is your potion maker. Now, at the back. You are going to put your nether wart. Now I'm going to divide this. I was going to say into three, but I'm just going to divide it because it won't go into three. And I'm going to put 
the nether wart into the top one, right there. I'm going to put my main ingredient, which is going to be, which one do I want it to be? The puffer fish. I'll use my water breathing potion. So I'm going to put the puffer fish into that one, and I'm going to put the redstone into that one, or some of the redstone into that one. And then the glass bottles will be going into these at the bottom. I think I've got glass bottles. Yes, I have. So we've got some glass bottles. And I can just throw them in there. So I'm going to put three into that one. Did I pick that one up? Yes, I did. I'm going to put three into that one. And I'm going to put three into this one. Now, I think we're either facing south or north here. Uh, the ingredients will have to go in in a different order if you're facing east to west. Uh, but you can get that from the link in the description from 2020 MC Gaming because he has actually done the proper tutorial for it. Uh, and that's it. About done, guys. So if I press this button here... We've got the bottles in the machine, we've got the puffer fish, which is next, and then the redstone, and we should get our water breathing potion, and it is like an extended one. And put your blaze powder in as well, guys. Don't forget your blaze powder to activate your actual machine, because I am a noob at times. Never mind the snide comments, like, at times, yeah. Mmm. <laughs> Your blaze powder, guys, actually goes in there. Right, and then it'll start brewing. We'll give it a minute or two. I'm going to get, like, the basics on these ones. So I'm just going to pop that there. This is just while I'm waiting for the other one to... Brew, guys. I'm going to make you watch me build another two. Alright, so that's them two. Already I'm waiting. And then if you sit, look, you'll see your puffer fish is going into your awkward potion. And that should turn your awkward potion into a breathing potion. There you go. And if you add the redstone, that will extend the time of your water breathing. Uh, gunpowder gives you a splash potion. Redstone extends the time of your potion. So if it's a three minute and you put redstone in, it's going to turn into an eight minute, like so. And then to collect it and put it in your chest, hit that button, and there they are. Right, guys, I'm going to get on with the others, and I'll be back. So, guys. We've done all the machines, and I've just been on a wander to get myself some blocks and some steps to try and pretty the place up a little bit. Uh, right, I've got my chests here, and what I'm going to do in these spaces is put some chests. And it should fit in nicely to the walls, and that can put things like your nether wart in. Uh... Extra bottles in these ones, extra ingredients for your potions, yada, yada, yada. So, we've got the chests in place. These haven't got any buttons on just yet, because I forgot my buttons. But, hey-ho, it's the way it goes. Right, now, I'm going to use steps to actually decorate this up at the front. Okay. So at the front, not along to there, because I might just use normal blocks there. And I'm going to use that pickaxe, because the other one is my fortune pickaxe. And I don't want to be using that. So you could do something, probably, like this. But I'm going to need a slab at the bottom of it. And go along. Step there. Block there, there, and there. Step on this one. And then, you 
blocks coming down because this is where your door will be. Yeah, I think I should just get me uh, fingers out. That should match up with that. Have I not got any slabs? No, my slabs are downstairs. Right. So I'm going to need the slabs because I'm going to need to put the doors on. So we'll go for a quick wander into this chest down here. And we've got plenty of slabs to be working with. So let's get this thing decorated up, guys. And then we'll see what the final result looks like. So that on to there. See, it's going to stop there, but that's not a problem. Now, I want the rest of it in front of the machines to be glass. Not there, and not there, and not there. Get your slabs in, like so. Put your blocks on. Bring that up with a slab. Put your door on. And put another one there. Now that is going to be glass. So I can see through. That one in there. This one like this. And then that. I like so. I think that's got to come off, hasn't it, for a step. Like that. Step, 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 and step. That one off. Step on. That one and that one. I'm going to take that. I'm going to pop that there. We're going to get this covered up, like so, and this one, like so. We're going to put our glass in, ding, ding, ding. You might want to keep that one out, or oh, it's going to be quite hard for you to get your blaze powder in the machine. And then we're going there, and then we're going there, guys. We're going to stick our slab in there, and we're going to pop our door on. And then we're going to step back, and that is going to be our potion area, guys. Our lovely little screenshotted potion area. Do you think about that? We've got all the chests we need. We're growing our wart in the little wart farms that we've got dotted about the area. And I think that looks pretty nice. So guys, if you've enjoyed this episode, give it a big fat thumbs up. And if you'd like to see a little bit more of just him, hit that subscribe button. And don't forget the notification bell. Thanks for watching guys. And I'll see you in the next one. Toodaloo.